गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन माई टॉपिक इज अ स्टडी ऑन रिपीटेबिलिटी एंड एग्रीमेंट ऑफ केरिस्ट्री एंड रिफ्रेक्टिव प्रिडिक्शन बिटवीन वेरियो एंड आयल मास्टर द रेशनली ऑफ कंडक्टिंग दिस स्टडी इज टू असेस द एफिकसी ऑफ वेरियो इमेज गाइडेंस सिस्टम इन रिड्यूसिंग द रेसिडियल एस्टिग्मेजम इन पेशेंट अंडर गोइंग कैटरक सर्जरी द प्री ऑपरेटिव प्लानिंग फॉर कैटरक सर्जरी इन्वॉल्व रिलायबल एक्यूरेट मेजरमेंट ऑफ द ग्लो The Varion is a system having reference unit, planning unit, and digital markers. It helps to assess, plan, and guide the surgeon throughout yeah, the good, surgical good. procedure, aiming to minimize the postoperative residual astigmatism. The measurement module of the Varion is a non-contact point keratometric device. It captures a high-resolution pre-operative reference image, which is used to document the center of the pupil, corneal reflex position, eccentricity of the visual axis. scleral vessels iris structures it measures the biometric ocular parameters like corneal radii magnitude of astigmatism limbal position and diameter the planning module of the varion it uses the reference images and the pre operative measurement to plan the cataract surgery it uses the existing different eye formulas to determine the location of incision number of location as well as the proper eye oil selection so the purpose of the study is to analyze the predictability of the instruments for calculation of iol power and k reading yes, sure, as well as the variant predicted st with the final follow up final prescription the objective was to compare the iol power between variant planner and iol master to compare the k reading between two machines and to assess the efficacy of variant planner to predict the post operative outcome a prospective randomized observational study was carried out the statistical analysis was done with the paired sample t test and pearson correlation coefficient test 120 eyes were examined the incision size is 2.2 2.8 in 3 mm it is all clear corneal temporal incisions now the correlation between pre op k1 and a varion k1 and iol master k1 there is a strong correlation and similarly in the uh, pre op iol master k2 and variant k2 there is a strong correlation the similar study was done by the grober namely it also shows that it is the varion is a suitable alternative tool for the clinical practice now the correlation between the varion predicted final st and the final st subjective test at 2 month in 2.2 mm group it shows a, a strong correlation between the varion predicted cylinder and the final st cylinder the ansu such that it also shows there is no significant difference in accuracy between the two system but it has an additional role in astigmatic uh, astigmatic management as the varion it may help to refine the post operative serifer refractive prediction the similar uh, 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 observation was found in 2.8 mm group where there is a strong correlation between varion predicted cylinder and the final st cylinder the image guided lens extractor surgery the study done by irini et al shows that the accuracy and reliability of both the machines however the varion is very useful in convention manual ink marking techniques for the toric iol management uh, correlation between the varion predicted st and final st in 3 mm group there is a strong correlation between the varion predicted cylinder and the final st cylinder the varion system rusibella also shows that the varion system provide a consistent measurement of keratometric values now correlation between iol master and varion power there is a significant difference the similar study was done by takayasi et al shows that the optimization of iol constant in the varion is vital and once you optimize the iol constant the varion is more accurate as compared to the iol master uh varion predicted and post operative accepted refraction by the patient has a less significant difference just because most of the patient are comfortable without a small correction of plus or minus 2.5 diopter so such correction are not prescribed to the patients and because of the high repeatability it may enjoy an increasing role in today's cataract surgery hmm? especially at the toric iols no, The varion system still requires the axial length values from another device. Thus, for a same a constant, any difference in post-operative expected outcome must be explained by the difference in actual measurement of k readings. So, to conclude, uh, the varion is a new technology to give a reliable expected refractive outcomes. 
Varion and Iol Master together can be used for achieving near emetropia postoperatively and for the better suggestion of IOLs. Thank you. Thanks, ma'am. No, no. <laughs> uh, uh, doctor, that, that, that is a very nice presentation, doctor. But in your series of patients, how many patients needed a different lens as far as sphere is concerned and as far as the toricity is concerned when, when you compare Iwell Master 700 with the Varion during the surgery? So you are basically comparing preoperative measurement with intraoperative measurement. Uh, it's basically preoperative prediction done by the Varion. Varion has a planning unit which predicts the postoperative outcomes. So we have compared that Varion predicted outcome with uh, final ST which we give to the patient. So, so uh, compared to I will master 500 data huh. and, and which formula did you use in the, in the from in, the? Uh, in all patient we use a Barrett formula. You use the online Barrett's or, or the one which is present with, within present the? Present with the Varion and for the, uh, yes with the Varion. Ma'am you are, you are aware that as far as toric calculations are concerned the online Barrett story calculator is far superior to the uh, software which is which is there within the uh, which is there within the Varion or with the uh, I will master 500. Okay. The online software gets updated at least once a year and sometimes twice a year. So those formulas are far better as far as the torsity is concerned. So your paper is to compare between the predictability and the agreement. Yeah. So what was the uh, predicted uh, sphere and cylinder by I will master uh, 500? And with the Varion, we need those two tabular columns, ma'am. Yeah. Uh, we have compared the prediction of Varion, the Varion which has prediction and the final outcome which we have prescribed to the patient. And we have compared the IOL master and Varion for the K-reading values. So you did that only for the K-reading values, not for the choosing not the, the, the choosing not, not for choosing the, the intraocular lens. No. So you chose the intraocular lens only based on the Varion readings, not on the on the eyeball master. But when we, we calculate every uh, we calculate the lens power with the both the machine, but what we have implanted is according to the Varion, and the difference between two is significant. Which the eyeball power which we uh, find out with the help of eyeball master or with the Varion, there is a significant difference. But in this study, we have implanted all the eyeball power according to the. A suggestion done by the Varion machine. But what about biometry? It comes from the IOL master? No, it the is calculated axial within the axial length is from uh, IOL master. master. So that is the limitation. So any difference given point, any uh, difference you find in uh, predictive uh, outcome is just because of change in the uh, K reading. So we need to optimize the uh, A constant. That is uh, Ma'am, you are, you are referring to the K reading after the cataract is removed. Are you talking about that? Or, you, or, or, or you're talking about the pre-operative? Pre-operative. Pre 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 